Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Stephanie D. Burroughs, president of Stephanie Speaking. We're a speaking, training, and navigating company, and we basically focus on minority, women, small, and veteran business owners, especially those of you who are going after government contracts. I'm talking about don't give up today because of something that occurred and it signified to me how many business owners go through the same challenge. So if you're a business owner out there and you're encountering, encountering some challenges or situations where you feel like just quitting, don't. Here's an example. So I was at an event today, an awesome event, fierce networking. And you all know how I am about networking. If there's an opportunity for you to get out there and promote yourself, promote your business, whether or not it's for your business, or even if you're looking for a job or whatever it is that you're promoting, make sure that you're targeting specific types of events that are going to have people there that will be suitable or that meet your niche marketplace. But today was all about small business and it was about capitalization. It was about awards. It was about really um, celebrating the successes that a particular organization had had over the year. There were a number, oh, it was a large turnout, really big turnout. I, I have to say it was, they, they ought to be proud of themselves. They did exceedingly well. And a number of people that I've been blessed and thankful and grateful to be able to work with as both clients and in training as well, did manage to come out. I hope that they really maximize that opportunity. I know a couple that I saw who did. They really worked the floor when the time came to network and to talk to the people who helped. There was promise of them being able to um, effectuate a relationship, create a relationship, to acquire information that they needed in order to grow their businesses. And to also begin that whole relationship dating piece. Now, there were those who did not come. And here's where I'm a little concerned. Why didn't they show up? For some, it wasn't a matter of not making the effort. The effort was made. The challenge was not being able to perhaps find the right parking place or space or the parking lot or maybe not really being familiar with the territory and understanding how to get from one point A to point B, hence parking lot to the event. Not really knowing the landscape. Well, listen, in business, we're always in a place where we don't know the landscape. We're always going to step out there into the great beyond and not know exactly what that landscape is going to look like in advance and not really be certain of how we're going to navigate it. But that's the fun of being in business, being a risk taker, being an entrepreneur. The key is to not give up. I know what happened in one instance. I've been in that situation. I've gone somewhere and on my way, navigation went one way and it wasn't the way that I thought it was supposed to be, but I followed it and it really wasn't the way I thought it was supposed to be. Needed to find another way around it. Um, there were challenges with it. At least I was using a navigator. So if you don't use one, <laughs> but sometimes you'll encounter challenges. Sometimes you got to take a breath and just sit still and let everything calm down and allow yourself to center. If you're like me, I'm saying a prayer, <laughs> asking for specific instruction and directions. And it never fails, not for me anyway. And then sometimes just letting the navigator rest for a minute and recalculate and perhaps putting in another address that's close to where I'm going. Whatever it is, I'll try a number of different, I won't try, I will use a number of different strategies in order to get back on track. Yes, there have been times I thought, oh man, I'm late. I'm gonna be so late, I'm lost. I don't know how to do this, where am I? And then I'm like, yo, what? This is the grit factor talking. What are you saying? 
I know that whenever I get to wherever I'm going to go, I'm right on time. I'm on time for me. There's a reason why I wasn't there beforehand. I don't need to know the reason. I just know that when I get there, it's the right time. So that's not the issue. Now we just need to figure out how to get there. But I don't give up. There's that inkling that'll come along. You know that feeling, those lies and feelings, you know, that come along and say, oh, forget about it. Just turn back and go on back. No way, Jose. When I've come this far, there is no way in the world I'm turning back around to go some to go back. When I'm getting this close, I know I'm close. I just have to change it up a little bit. Don't quit. Don't give up. Take a moment. Gather yourself. Gather your wits, center yourself, calm yourself. Think of other alternatives for finding your way there. If the navigator is really jacked up, you know what, find your way to a gas station. You can put in gas station. It'll take nearest gas station. It'll take you there and ask for directions. Whatever it's going to take for you to find your way, get there. Don't give up. Sometimes that navigator is helping you along the way in your business. And I'm not talking about the ones in your cars. It's an internal navigator, but sometimes you need an external navigator, someone who can help point out the way for you. Don't give up. There's always help. You just need to ask. You need to stop and think. More importantly, think, who am I asking? Why do I ask? What do I ask? Where? You know, when you start asking enough questions, you'll come up with the right question. And guess what? The answer will come to you. So when you're looking for a navigator, when you're getting stuck, don't give up. Make the phone call. Here I am, Stephanie D. Burroughs. What did I tell you I do? Speaker, trainer, navigator, and author. We're here to help you navigate your way. If it's in government contracting, I'll help you there. If it's in personal development, especially when it comes to thought therapy, which is my little brand of specialty for women business owners, I'm here for you. The key is to not give up. I'm also known as the grit factor because I believe in growing grit for greatness. And I speak to that a great deal of the time. And I also believe in you self-inspiring yourself and not looking outside of yourself for someone else to inspire you. See, a lot of you, you give up. Because you're looking outside of yourself for someone else to inspire you. And it's already in you. You just need a little help in navigating yourself to that deep inner space where your inspiration lies. You'd be so surprised at the strength that you gain from that. That comes up and engulfs you. So even if you are in a position where you feel I am so lost and I think I should just give up because I, I don't know what I'm doing and I don't know where I'm going and I don't know how to do this. First, I want you to know you have everything you need already to be successful. Don't quit. Don't give up. Oftentimes we quit or give up just before the breakthrough. Don't quit. Don't give up. Seek help and look for a navigator like me. You can find me at www.stephaniespeaking.com. And oh, by the way, if you'd like a free gift, I'd love to share something with you, some tips and strategies on helping you to become much more effective in your networking and in your matchmaking meetings. Just text the word networking to 908-223-8616. That's a free gift for you. Just text the word networking to 908-223-8616. The whole point of this story is don't give up. Not when you come so far. Not when you've put so much into it. All the preparation that went into it. I know the preparation that went into it for this person, for them to get as close as they got. But due to uncertainty and allowing feelings and frustration, which is self-induced, 
to overcome them. They may have turned back. And they didn't have to. Don't give up. I'm Stephanie D. Burroughs, president of Stephanie Speaking. I look forward to communicating with you. So make sure that you check me out at www.stephaniespeaking.com to find out how you can make an appointment to speak with me or you can book me for an opportunity to speak and inspire your organization or your audience. And we'll be talking again soon. Have a blessed day.